Here is how you transfer data from old iPhone to new iPhone 16 Pro. But first, hit the like and subscribe buttons down below. It really helps me out. Thank you. First of all, our iPhone 16 Pro needs to show the Hello screen when we wake the phone up. If your 16 Pro shows the lock screen and home screen instead, we must factory reset the 16 Pro by opening settings, then select general, then scroll to the bottom and select the reset option, and we will need to erase all content and settings. Once our 16 Pro is on the hello screen, we now need to look at our old iPhone and open the settings app in your old device, then select Wi-Fi and make sure this is on and head to Bluetooth and also make sure this is on as well. Now in our 16 Pro, we're going to swipe up the screen. We will select our language and country or region. We will select continue for appearance and stay on the quick start screen. On the old iPhone, it should show a prompt. If nothing is showing, just restart the phone. We now see the set up new iPhone prompt and we will tap on continue on our old device. We now need to scan this bubble using the camera on our old phone. If the bubble doesn't scan, tap the authenticate manually option. So I'll scan the old code and then the old iPhone will connect to the new one. It will transfer your language and some other settings. You will now see set up new iPhone and we'll select set up for me and we'll enter in our old iPhone passcode. If your old iPhone has a SIM card in, you have the option to transfer the eSIM from your old device, sometimes even move the physical SIM card into eSIM. If you select set up later in settings, you can set up the eSIM later. You don't have to set up eSIM or insert a SIM card now. It can be done at any time. Once you see transfer your data option, you can either transfer from iPhone directly or download from iCloud. Now, I recommend transfer from iPhone, but use download from iCloud if the other option, transfer from iPhone, is not working. So I'll select this option. The launch software on iPhone 16 Pro seems to have a bug where the 2FA codes don't send. So if you're having that bug, select didn't get a code, and you'll need to text a code to your phone number to get the 2FA instead. If you see the transferring data starting, then you're good to go. If you're asked to update the software, try this software update. If it stops working for some reason, check out my fixed video in the description. After data transfer is completed, you wanna make sure you are signed into all of your apps because some apps will make you want to sign in again. Make sure you do this before you erase your old iPhone.